step block. So I cut these onions in half. It gives me two baits per onion. Bit of mullet gut and some white bait. I'll put them in together. That mullet gut soaks in and sort of goes through all the white bait. Put a bit of water in that and uh, it'll unfreeze. That should do me for about an hour's session. So the combo I'm using today, Kuma, it's a barbarian, and I'm using the uh, size 20 of Pixar. It's got to be one of my favourite reels, absolutely excellent reel, it looks great, it's nice and light. But right now it's low tide, or it was about an hour ago. It's exposing a lot of the shallow reefs, so the, the rocky patches, probably only 10 to 15 metres out, Lots of weed, lots of rock, and there's, there's about a foot, foot and a half of water over and around those rocks. So the rig I'm using is an unweighted rig, uh, no sinker at all, six pound, six pound uh, leader on five pound braid. It's just a 1-0 hook right through the top of the uh, mullet there, and that's my presentation. So I put my first two baits just in front of the rocks and no joy. I'm going to flick this one just up beside the rocks and give that a shot. Yep, there's the first fish. Feels like a decent fish too. Just smash that bait. It's quite a big onion too. Just get it over this little ledge and walk with it a bit. Oh, here's our first fish. Quite a decent brim too. That's a cracker brim. we will probably go 32, 33. Nice way to start the morning. Right on 34. That is just a stonker way to start the day. Very happy with that. Catch a few more of them and I'll go home. A very happy camper. To give you an idea of the structure we're fishing around, see the little shells and the weed on this rock? Well, that gravel, that's gravelly stuff right through here, and that's why the brim come in. They fit around this weed, this rock. At the moment, the wind's blowing from the south or southeast. There's still a fairly slack tide, so my bait's drifting north. Just holding the rod to the north so I can see the line and the bait's coming toward the rod. And because there's no weight on it, I'm just winding in the slack as it drifts back toward my rod. I'm watching the rod closely here and I'm waiting for the flicks. There's a bit of activity there, it's still, still just flicking, but the fish hasn't actually picked the bait up and run. You'll see the rod actually bend when that happens. There's a little bit of a bend, but what I'm waiting for is the rod to bend over and stay bent over, and then I just set the hook. Still a bit of activity there. That was a better pick up, he's picked it up well there. He's picked it up, dropped it, still playing with it.
And there it is, there it is. And it's a good fish too, it feels good. What have we got? The brim that bloody. Ah, oh, another nice brim. That is a good brim. It's not quite as big as the last one, but it'll be closing in 28 to 30. Not too shabby at all. Ah, the gut is doing the damage today. Go on like last week's pay. I'm away from the wind. I hope you can hear this. But see my presentation there. Plenty of hook exposure. You can see the whole back of the hook. That's not worrying the brim at all. Once through the little onion. And then a few threads through the actual gut. Just to keep a bit there. It doesn't matter to me if that falls off when it gets out there. Acts as a bit of a burly trial. And uh, that there is just the 1 0 bait keeper hook. Here we go, here we go, and we're on again. Nice fish. Hear the drag run there. It is only five pound braid and six pound leader. Although I did change up actually, it's five pound braid and ten pound leader. And it's a bit smaller this one, but still legal. He's taken the soft mullet gut here. There's no onion on this one. And uh, you'll pick up the smaller brim without the onion. Got quite a big onion on this one. Oh, and we're on again. Nice fish, this one. Feels good. Picking these brim up only meters from my feet. They're not far out at all. Number four for the day. A really good session here this morning. Probably only been here about an hour, hour and a bit. Very nice brim, very healthy. We've had one really good one around that 34 and the other three around this 26 to 30 mark. Well today was a little session down here at, uh, at uh, Margate or between Margate and, and Woody Point. Went a few nice brim on Stonker. The damage today was all done on mullet gut using an onion for weight so absolutely no sinkers. And just a 1 0 hook, and the hook was a, a bait keeper. The uh, combo is a Akuma Barbarian 10 foot soft tip rod, it's full bait for exactly what I'm doing here today, and it's paired with a size 20 the Pixel 5 pound braid. And uh, I started with a 6 pound leader and I went up to a 10 pound leader because it got smashed on the rocks just out here a couple of times, and it was a bit frustrating, but. Them's breaks. Got a few all released today. Well, folks, that brings us to the end of another video. Thank you very much for watching. Hit the like button for me, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.